Alright, what's up guys? Um, so if you can't tell by the title of this video, yes, we have tie-dye shirts now. Yes. If you guys want to get these tie-dye shirts, make sure to go to www.undialed.co co, and yeah, you can buy your shirts there. But at this current point in time, when I'm doing this right now, the tie-dye shirts are not actually done yet, and we actually have to make them right now. So right now I'm just filling up some bottles of dye. Um, we have a whole bunch of different colors. We have an array of colors. We even have some on the table too. We have lots of colors. And basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna tie-dye some shirts and show you guys how to do it. So if you guys wanna do it to your own undialed lit shirt, you guys can do it. So let's, get, let's hop right into it. The first thing that you need to do is you need to get a tie-dye kit. I got this one from Michael's, it was like $7. And basically it's gonna come with a little bottle with some powder in the bottom and you just gotta fill it up to the line. All right, right there on the line. Make sure to screw the top back on. Boom. And there's gonna be some powder at the bottom of it if you guys can see this. You guys basically just gotta shake this up until the powder is gone. Bam. All right, well, the powder is now dispersed into the water that's in here and this dye is ready to go. Next, we're gonna meet you at the table and we're gonna start dyeing some shirts. So let's get to it. I like that shirt, Will. What? This shirt? Wow. Wow! If you guys want these white shirts, we're only gonna be making this one run of white shirts. So if you want a white shirt, make sure to get it now and dial the coat. Right now, we're about to tie dye this shirt, so let's get to it. So I left the end of the table right here uncovered in plastic because right here is where we're gonna fold up the shirts. So for the first shirt, what I'm gonna do is they say you have to grab in the middle and then pinch it and swirl it around, but I think it'd be kinda of cool if the tie-dye swirl went around the lit logo. So I'm gonna grab right in the middle of the lit logo right here and start just like winding it up. And basically you just take your fingers and then just like slowly just twist it around and it should just start folding into like a circle like this. Bam, all right. Now I have this, all I need to do now is get my rubber bands, put rubber bands around the outside. And this is another thing, it doesn't have to be perfect guys because at the end of the day, you are tie-dyeing something. So it's not like it's geometrically symmetrical or anything, it's, it's kind of just uh, luck making it look sick. All right, making sure this is still up at the top, bam. I'm gonna put the cross of my rubber bands right in the middle of the lit logo so I can know how to like section out each of the areas. I'm gonna put a couple more rubber bands on. All right, well, I got the shirt right here. It's in a nice little bun. Next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna start tie dyeing the shirt. So, because people are hyped on my deck right now, I'm gonna do this shirt the color of my screw deck, which is pink, teal, and like purple, or violet. So I'm gonna do those three colors. Let's get to it, let's go. So the first thing I'm gonna get is I'm gonna get my teal. It looks pretty similar, right? Yeah. And I'm gonna do the first couple sections. When I tied up my tie-dye into sections with the rubber bands, I made it so that each little section is like a slice of pizza. And basically what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna color in each little slice. Um, and yeah, let's do it. Make sure when you're tie-dyeing, you get like in between all the grooves of the shirt too. I'm just gonna do the outline layer of it and then go in and do all the grooves, so. All right, afterwards, your shirt should look like this. Um, next thing you gotta do, got my trash bag. Just put your shirt in the trash bag. Bam. Why do you put your shirt in the trash can, Will? Put it onto the world's longest scooter deck. That's mandatory or else it's not gonna turn out. Sorry. Oh. Hey there. We're gonna tie dye some lit shirts, boys. I wish they would pop. Here we go, like. Same thing. What Will did, I'm gonna take this glove off again so I can actually grip this. 
then I'll put them on later. But act like they're, I put them on later. So I'm gonna do the same thing Will did. I thought that was a actually really cool idea. And I'm just gonna swirly swirl it. Ernie's calling. Ernie, guess what? What's up, Clayton? We, we have lit shirts available on undial.co. Bro, you got lit shirts available on undial.co? Yes. Bro, I gotta get off the phone and order one right yes, now. Yes, right now. Go, 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 Ernie. Bro, bro, bro. I, you know what? I'm gonna pull it up right here. How much? For only $25? Only $25? Only $25. Dang. I gotta get six. Only 25 Pop the cap. Drop the cap. Pop a cap? Pop another cap, drop the cap. Make it rain. Uh -huh. That looks beautiful. That's all I'm gonna do. Green! Lots of green. Watch it soak in there. Oh, but it ain't soaking in. Cause that's how high quality these shirts are. They're waterproof. Waterproof shirt. Waterproof shirt. shirt. All right, folks, that's all I'm doing. It's gonna look sick. Look at that poop scoop. <laughs> <laughs> the poop scoop. All right, two down. I don't know how many to go, but we're gonna have them done, right? What's good, everyone? So, it's the morning time now, and we got the shirts. They're still in the little baggies, and now I gotta wash them out, but first I'm gonna move my knives. Next, I'm gonna take the shirt out of the baggie and unband it and wash it out. Ooh, this is looking actually pretty sick so far. I'm just looking at the colors of it really quick. And the nice blue fading into green. I'm stoked to see how this shirt looks. Squeeze it and drink a little bit. Oh! Dang. That looks so tight. I'm so impressed by that, honestly. Oh wow. This one looks so nice as well. Yeah, all right, we got the next little bun of shirt. Wash it out and see what color it really. Ooh, it looks green. Oh. That's so sick. Dang. Oh my gosh. There's so much dye come out of there. How good did Will do on his shirt? Ooh. Oh, this is another one I did. I try not to do that much, just to kind of leave it as white as possible. Because as of right now, it looks kind of bleh, but it might turn out, yeah. Oh, that does look so sick. Oh my god. Oh, that looks tight. I know. I know. No need to tell me. I know I'm amazing at making shirts sick. So, as you guys can tell, we have a bunch of different shirts it's because they're a bunch of different sizes. So we will be announcing later. Oh, we don't want that going down there. But we'll uh, be announcing at some point in this video that you can go into dial.co and purchase these shirts. All right, so I got my next shirt right here. It's a, uh, it's like a, I think it's like a teal and pink. It's like a lot of purple in it too. This is one of the first shirts that I did. So I'm gonna unwrap it so it looks. Oh wow, lit. Oh my gosh. That looks pretty crazy. Last one. It's the last shirt. Um, this is like one of the last shirts I did because I used the fat rope bands on it. That one looks sick. That looks so sick. <laughs> Throwing all these in the washer and we'll see you when they're done. How are you feeling about these shirts? These shirts look absolutely unbelievable. I'm so hyped on how they turned out. Honestly, like, 
I didn't, I, I really, really genuinely didn't think they would turn out this good, but I'm so stoked. For example, the ones we were showing in the sink, you couldn't really see the lit logo that well on the shirt. But once we took it out, you can see like, this is the darkest one. And it's like, you can see it pretty visibly. And then on other ones, it's super visible. Like this one right here. Bam, super visible, looks so good. I'm hyped on how these shirts came out. So I'm gonna go over the shirts. Um, this is gonna go the small sizes to large sizes just so I can show you guys all the shirts now that they're done and not just wet in the sink. So the shirt that is on the top, which is youth medium, is this one. This is a youth medium. This is, no, I forget who did this one, but yeah, I think this one turned out pretty cool. It's like a purple and green, looks sick, I'm stoked. Next one we have going down is a youth large. And this one is probably one of the most vibrant ones that we have. Next one we got going down is another Youth Large, which is the purple and blue. I think this one looks cool. I like how the star kind of like comes out from the lit logo. It looks sick. That's why we tied them up around the lit logo so that would happen. All right, the next one I have going down is the small size shirt. And this one is like a color of the pink, green, blue. It has a lot of everything in it. Um, I like how it has a majority of white on it, or not majority, it just has more white than the other shirts. I think that looks really cool, so. The next one going down is the blue and green shirt. This one was spun up right in the middle, because you can see the, the, like, the outshoots going from, yeah. I think this one looks really cool, it's like a light blue and light green, and like a, kind of like a neon green. It looks nice. I, I like it a lot, it's like subtle colors. It's like a subtle neon green, I don't know how it's possible. Um, the next one we have going down is the large size, and this one is the predominantly white shirt, but it's kind of in tinted blue, so it looks kind of cool. I, I like it a lot. It has green highlights in it too, it has like green in the sleeve, and the whole thing is pretty much blue green. The last two are both XL, and uh, this one is the white and purple one. It kind of looks like a white and a dark blue now, but. Yeah, it was like a purple and blue. It looks cool, I'm hyped on it too. It has some green down here as well. The last shirt we have is another XL, and this is a purple and really light blue and white one. Swirled around the lit logo as well. So, I'm super stoked on it. I think it looks cool. The violet really comes out in it, and it's super vibrant, so. If you guys want to get these shirts, these are a one-off uh, run of shirts. We're, we're probably not gonna do any more of white, tie-dyed shirts for a while so if you guys want to get these shirts these are the only ones being made um, make sure to go to www.undialed.co and pick these up for yourselves all right have an enjoyable rest of your day guys and we'll catch you later peace out